Hello Internet! So the story behind wanting to make these cards originated over a year ago when I signed up for a gym. I'd regularly attend this one yoga class and the instructor was a sweet and bubbly character. And what was interesting about her particular class was the fact that she didn't use the regular names for the typical yoga and Pilates poses that I'm sure any seasoned yogi would be familiar with. Instead, she had a cute spin on it. For instance, the downward dog, she called that the mountain pose. And I think that's pretty smart considering the triangular shape the body takes on with that pose. It was extremely cute and and each time I attended a class, I'd honestly get sidetracked as I guess, you know, the creative hemisphere of my brain took hold and would consume me with these well thought out visions of these cards. It might have taken me forever to finally put my thoughts on paper so that I wouldn't be bothered during class, but then it took me even longer to actually execute it. I mean, I could have just left this and, you know, have it be out of sight and out of mind, but then I figured, why not? I knew how to execute the idea, and I thought why not now considering, you know, it's a good time, it's about to be Christmas, and this would be a really cute token or a really nice gift. Actually, I missed out on this opportunity last Christmas. The gym had individual stockings hung up for each instructor, and I did hint at her that I wanted to give her something, and ultimately, I didn't, sadly, clearly. <laughs> but anyway, here's just the sped up and somewhat chaotic process of it all. Truly, I'm no expert when it comes to designing an illustrator. I just have the basic knowledge based on what I know and what I was taught. I'm sure any seasoned professional or anyone more familiar than I am right now with the application could easily point out that certain things I've done are either long-winded or unnecessary when there's probably a shortcut key or a better method to approach to achieve you know, certain elements. I was just going with my own creative flow here and there is some method to the minor madness but uh, I did not look up any new methods at this time. So for instance, my misgivings with the alignment, even despite the revision, was still not right when I got it printed double-sided. If I had gone to the printer shop like I originally planned, since I would have liked these to have been printed on thicker cardstock with a nice glossy finish, I could have asked the shop clerk to help me out with that alignment issue. But, you know, I decided to go down the more budget-friendly path, so I just had to print them separately and sandwich them together on the lamination sheet, as you'll see later. And then all that was left was to cut them out, round off the edges so that it wouldn't cut anyone, and wrap it up. So, I actually can hold my idea in my hands, and now all I hope is that she likes it.